Hello. Uh, yeah. So this actually, I wanted to make a one meter twenty big variant of this one, but um, I noticed I didn't have enough wire, so I opted for a seventy centimeters just to make a test because it's all made of MDF wire. Well, and of course mylar and such, but uh, yeah, it is uh, uh, like not the solid core wire, but the normal wire. And I did something like this years, years, years back with uh, the Louvre, uh, the light Louvres uh, that are in ceilings and such, the egg crates. But uh, yeah, it's not a very nice material and... Uh, yeah, it's, it's just not so nice to work with. So I thought I'll try to do the same with MDF. This is cheap MDF, uh, 15 millimeters thick. Um, and I think if I have the proper MDF, I could maybe use 12. That would be nice. Uh, and I did some stuff by hand, or actually not, not by hand, but I used my CNC as a router table because depth of cut is kind of a problem uh, on my CNC because my uh, my bed is not flat everywhere. Or it is when I just like uh, made it flat, but uh, it's outside and moisture and such, it will deform the uh, MDF spoil plate. Although it's good MDF this time and it, it's, it's a world of difference, it's still, I don't trust it yet. Uh, and also, I screw down a lot of stuff on the MDF, uh, so it will create like sort of bumps. So it's not never flat anymore, or I have to like flat it first and then make this kind of thing. Now I did some stuff by hand that had uh, needed accuracy in the z-axis. It would be nice if you just, it could be done by only CNC, which is saving a lot of time drinking coffee. You. But uh, anyhow, can they be efficient? Yes, they can. They play with 1 to 6 T ratio. Voltage is, I don't know, exactly quite high, I think. Uh, could be a little bit lower, but it's 9 dB down on the woofer. So that's uh, almost in the realm of the, of the planar tweeters I made. Uh, yeah. I made another contraption that actually, this one, only uses the solo sound channels. I'm not sure if this is in frame. And also in, on an angle like they do in the original solo sound. But this surface area is the same or maybe even bigger than that one, this one. But this one is less loud. So I'm not sure. I like the wires better, I think. So, but let's play ch tune. Let's do a clap. And it's nice that you have so much headroom. Uh, the only problem now is that the woofer is at its limit and the ESL doesn't care much. Cross that 450, uh, 12 to be brought up. An ocean and rock, Lisa Herringen. I bet she's from uh, Denmark or something. But uh, any house, here we go. I don't think the Wolver can handle more than this.
pleased actually more pleased than uh, about the solo sounds uh, benefit of using wire of course it's uh, quite good isolated to begin with you don't have to do anything uh, for it which is nice the only thing is get it straight of course but um, uh, I only made photos of this construction because I wanted to test it for my well I just wanted to test it myself not so much make a video about it if it's complete utterly uh, utter failure then it doesn't make for a good video, although I normally post failures as well, but it holds me back in, um, well, speed. And actually it took me six hours to make, so that's way too much, but I also had to make like tools to make it. So uh, it could be done uh, way faster, of course, but especially if my table would be flat, that would be uh, awesome. But uh, yeah. So no tiny noises or anything from the high voltage, no, it's just silent. The only thing you hear is my oven. But uh, yeah, uh, I'm going to play some more, I guess. Maybe I'm going to try and mate it with the open bevel over, see if, uh, if they manage to catch up, because they're rather efficient. Who knows? See you around. <laughs> 